Hi, this is Nick with Cabot Guns, and today we're gonna to talk about 1911s and red dots. As recently as three years ago, I would hear people say that red dots are only for competition pistols, or that's a fad, or I would never carry that on a defensive gun. But if anything, the last couple years has shown us that red dots aren't only the future, they are the here and now. So we actually designed a plate and a, a system specifically for our pistols to be able to mount red dots on 1911s, get it as low and far back as possible while still having co-witness sights. Now there are a couple of challenges when mounting full size red dots to 1911s. The first is the actual slide is too narrow for the footprint for most full size footprints like the RMS or the venerable Trigicon RMR footprint. This is an SRO, but Trigicon uses the same footprint for the RMR and the SRO. So what we had to do is create a mount that goes in between the slide and the red dot to make sure that there's enough mounting surface to get the dot to sit on the slide. Now, unlike most red dot mounting solutions, we chose to use 416R for our mount base in order to match our pistol and to be able to source it from domestic steel. Our mount is designed to move your dot as low and far back as possible so that if you are using an SRO, the hood does not overhang the ejection port and you can still have integrated backup co-witness sights. Now, if you spec your cabot with the red dot mount, the front sight is automatically gonna be a black serrated co-witness height front sight. Now, beyond the function of the mount and the red dot, having the mount as low and far back as possible also allows the greatest holster compatibility that we've seen adding a red dot mount. We don't have a comprehensive list, but give us a call and we'll tell you exactly what holsters we've tested, our guns with the mount and SROs or RMRs to fit. Now the last thing about our red dot mount system is since it's so low, you do need to use the supplied screws with our mount if you're using a Trigicon RMR or SRO. If you're using a hollow sun red dot, the screws supplied by hollow sun are the proper thread pitch and those are the proper length to work, but the ones for Trigicon we've provided in the system. So there you have it. We know red dots are here to stay. This is actually my personal gun that I carry with a Trigicon SRO. So having red dots and a solid mounting solution is very, very important to us. So if you're looking for a Cabot with a red dot, we do offer this mount on almost all of our models.